Well, thank you for coming back. If you are indeed coming back, if you're joining us, when I say us, I mean me, unless you consider some sort of duplication thing to happen when you have your voice because it's a recording. So it's like basically creating an alternate universe someplace else inside a machine. So it, it is we. It is we because it's you and me. And maybe you're listening to it with your friends. Maybe you're having a party. You're having a party right now listening to this show? Well, I appreciate that. It's not really a party kind of thing. But I don't, you know, who am I to judge what type of party it is that you want to have? When I say who am I to judge, I mean, I'm not to judge. <laughs> I'm not to judge. I'm not. Welcome back to Twisting the Wind. Thank you. This is an exciting time right now. Holiday, this is How can I help you? Hey, how's it going? Pretty good. Cool, yeah, pretty good. Me too. Hey, you hear about this uh, whole idea about peak oil? You know what I mean? No. Uh, it's this um, theory that's, uh, that the oil is going to run out. Okay. Do you, do you believe that? I have guess. You, have you ever heard of it? No. Yeah, I don't know. It's not like talked about much. It's not a very popular thing to talk about it, you know, because it's kind of like, kind of a, you know, a little dismal. You know what I mean? It's kind of not so optimistic, I guess, but, you know, it's, it's reality, yeah. right? What's better, reality or living in a dream? I don't know. Because <laughs> it's like, cause how much is gas right now? I can't tell you that over the phone. Oh, you really? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Why, why is that? You don't have to tell me. You just... Uh, just because of competitors. Oh, okay. So someone, like, would call up and they'd ask you how much theirs, yours is and they would make theirs, like... A little more or a little less? Probably less. Okay. I thought they didn't have a control over that price. I thought that price was kind of dictated by OPEC. You know about OPEC? No. Do you have a question or can I get back to work? Yeah, I was going to ask you if you um, know about OPEC. The, you know, um, no. oil, what is it? It's Petroleum X, Organization of Petroleum Exporting Countries. It's like the union of all the countries in you know, Middle East and whatnot, who export oil. Because, you know, the United States used to export oil back in the 70s and... Well, not 70s, before that, like in the 50s and stuff. Do you know that? Mm-mm. Like, we used to be a net exporter. And people buy oil from us, and then we used up all of our oil in the United States for the most part. And now we import almost like, I don't know, a huge... Over two-thirds of our oil is imported, maybe even more. So... And these, the, the oil in the Middle East and other places is running out. And that means that it's going to be less and less of it. It's going to cost even more money. You know what I mean? Isn't that crazy? Yeah. And like, yep. Isn't it, you realize how many things depend upon the use of cheap oil? Because it's pretty cheap if you think about it. You know? I like, guess, yeah. yeah. Like gas stations, like supermarkets, everything gets delivered there. You know, everything, everything that we got, we buy and sell goes on a truck. Those are all gas-powered. When people think electricity is it's clean, it's not. And not everything can be electric, you know. It's like they have a bunch of electric yeah. trucks. That's what, that's what peak oil is, is the idea that they've taken the most, the amount coming out of the ground has reached the highest level possible. Okay. You should check it out. I think it's interesting it's because it's coming. It's coming down the pipe. Right. That's the bad pun because it's literally not coming down the pipe.